Hey guys, Joey with Simply Vegas and the Chuck is Cruel Swall Group at bringing you another property tour. Today, I'm out here in Summerlin's Master Plan Community, which is located on the west side of the Las Vegas Valley. And we're gonna be taking a look at this home right behind me. Now this home is the Cedar Floor Plan by Taylor Morrison and the neighborhood is called the Cascades. Now this home is a four bedroom, four bathroom with a loft, rooftop deck, absolutely stunning views of the Las Vegas Valley, priced at 940,000. But I'm really excited to show it to you, so let's go take a look. And if you haven't subscribed to my channel, make sure you do and hit that like button. All right, guys, as we enter the home here, uh, we have nine foot ceilings, eight foot doors. Now this door was upgraded at the time of selecting the structural options. You can see here it has the opaque glass, which is really nice. Electronic keypad for the door. Here off to my left, we have the entrance to the garage, uh, tankless water heater, and the LiftMaster belt drive, which is really quiet. If you have a chain drive, you know what I'm talking about. You'll, you'll definitely notice the difference. Here we have the wood-like planks. Here, gray tone, which is very nice and neutral. And then here off to my left, we have a pantry. Here we have the nice island. Uh, this is gonna be about a seven to eight foot island, single basin stainless steel sink with a water filtration system, which is very important here in Las Vegas. Uh, if you don't have a water filtration system, you definitely wanna consider it just because of all the hard minerals in the water. But we have our granite countertops. Both are the same here on the perimeter and on the island. Beautiful shaker cabinets, overhead microwave. Now this one does vent out. A lot of people uh, think that these things will just blow back in your face like the old times, but now they do vent these out, which is great. We have our four uh, cooktop with our griddle here. Guys, let me know what you think about this backsplash. So I kind of dig it. It looks maybe it might be a little dated, but give me your opinion. Leave those comments below. So as you can see, we have a lot of storage space in this kitchen here. Here we'll have our refrigerator. Now this is gonna be a 26 inch refrigerator counter depth. Uh, we have a nice overhead storage there. Now as we make our way into the great room, family room, however you like to refer to it as, now this house is 2,242 square feet. So uh, they have to really make uh, good use of the space down here, but with the high ceilings, it does feel open. Uh, we have nice low, E windows, these are dual pane low E windows. These are all vinyl, so the heat transfer on a lot of these new homes uh, is very, very energy efficient. You're not gonna feel beat up by the sun. Now this is a north facing backyard, which I do recommend if you are looking for a home here in Las Vegas, north facing or south facing is definitely key. If you have a house that's facing west, you're gonna get beat up by the sun all day and you'll never use your backyard. Here we have our 10 foot Slider, now this was an upgrade with the builder. Uh, these upgrades typically cost around 10 to $12,000. Here we have our dining area. So making our way up here, upstairs, we have our first landing and off to my right is a powder bath with a pedestal sink. Now making our way upstairs, this is a straight shot so you're not gonna have a landing to turn. So as we come up to our second landing, we have a linen closet here for storage. We have this really nice window that faces west. So as you come up to this landing, you can really appreciate those beautiful views of Red Rock National Park. So making our way over here, we have three identical bedrooms, but what sets this one apart is the windows. We have two bedrooms that have standard windows. And in this bedroom here, we have three windows. Now this is really spectacular because you have this standard window like the other two bedrooms and then you have these two rectangle windows on this side which are gonna offer the best views on this floor. So here to break up the three bedrooms, they added this loft space which could be utilized as an office or maybe a play area for the kids. Now all three bedrooms are gonna share this bathroom but the good thing is that it has two sinks in the vanity. You also have the same color cabinetry as the kitchen as well as the similar flooring, not the same flooring but very similar flooring uh, to the downstairs. Now making our way down the hallway, this is a split floor plan, so you do have some distance between the primary bedroom and the other three bedrooms. Off here to my right is the laundry room, same tile as the bathrooms. So making our way here into the primary bedroom, the size is 12 by 15, but I'm gonna have all the exact measurements to the entire house in the description below. Here we have a J-Box pre-wire for our ceiling fan, four recessed upgraded lighting, 
these beautiful windows. Now this is gonna be west exposure, so they're gonna let in a little bit of light here, but you have this great balcony right off of the primary bedroom here. Now make your way here into the primary bathroom. We have a dual basin. This is a cultured marble or a Petrofina, if you will. Same cabinetry, full-size mirror, recessed lighting, shower tub combination with the fiberglass surround, but you also have another window here that faces east so you can take in those beautiful views that I keep talking about. Here we have our toilet as well as our walk-in closet. Now here off the primary bedroom, we have this amazing covered balcony. Now this was an upgrade at the time of contract when you have to select your structural options, but this is an eight by 12 north facing so you don't get beat up by the sun every day, but it's a beautiful place to come and enjoy your morning coffee or maybe take in one of those nice cool evening sunsets. But the million dollar view is right here, the Las Vegas Strip. Now making our way all the way up here to the loft, again, this is a straight shot all the way up. You have a modern horizontal rail, same color as the kitchen cabinets, but as we get up here, this is an eight by 15 space, which you can use it as an exercise room or even a theater room here because we have our coaxial uh, hook up here. We have our Smurf tube, a lot of windows, natural light, and you also have a powder bath. Now the bonus in this house is this rooftop terrace. So check this out. You have a 15 by eight rooftop terrace that makes perfect for a nice lounge area. But remember what I said about those million dollar views? Check this out. And here, as I mentioned before, you have a center opening slider that comes right out to your covered patio, brick pavers. Now, the backyard is really nice. Uh, believe it or not, most backyards here in Las Vegas are gonna be about 20 to 22 feet deep. This is about 30 feet deep. Now, you do have a higher wall here on the west side of the home because that elevation in the neighborhood is a little bit higher, so you're gonna have this retention wall. Now, a lot of people always ask me, hey, can we remove the retention wall? What can we do with it? You cannot remove the retention wall unless you resupport it. So if you're gonna be building a swimming pool, your swimming pool contractor uh, has all the details, so make sure you ask him. But what most people do is they put nice landscaping here with some up lighting, stucco and paint the wall to match the house, and it completely transforms your backyard. Now here on the east side of the house, it is a lower wall, but the neighborhood drops down, so you're at a much lower elevation. So all you can see are the rooftops of the houses next door. Now that's really great because most of these homes in Las Vegas are gonna be 10 feet in distance between each other, and they're gonna be really close on the backyard. So this yard, the way that it's situated, really feels nice and open. And if you haven't subscribed to my channel, make sure you do and hit that like button. Hey guys, thanks so much for taking the tour with me today. I really appreciate it. Just to recap, this is a four bedroom, four bathroom home, 2,242 square feet with a loft and outstanding views of the Las Vegas Valley. It's located in Summerlin's master plan and it was built by Taylor Morrison. This home is listed at 940,000 and it's never been lived in. So it's an amazing opportunity if you're looking for a brand new home to move into right away. Now I'm gonna include all of the information in the description below, as well as a link to the property listing. But if you have any questions, don't hesitate to reach out. And if you haven't subscribed to my channel, make sure you do and hit that like button. Until next time, I'll see you on the next video.